This is Iron Man's day in the life. He wakes up at 10 in the morning surrounded by two people whose names he's forgotten. For breakfast, Tony eats gluten-free waffles and a green smoothie with minimal pulp. Not no pulp, but a little bit of pulp. Tony then spends the next hour exercising split between Tai Chi and boxing while simultaneously signing documents he didn't read. It's now time to build a new suit so Disney can sell some more toys based on his likeness. Tony has a couple of donuts for his morning snack before he meets up with Spider-Man to teach him about great power and great responsibility. Responsibility. Spider-Man only gets a quick lesson today because Tony has tickets to the F1. At the race, Elon Musk tries to sell Tony X. Luckily, the awkward conversation is interrupted by crime happening out on the track, so Tony goes to take care of it. At lunch, Tony goes to meet up with his buddy Rhodey, where he eats a cheeseburger and pizza. It's not the healthiest choice, but he wanted to reward himself after defeating Cowboy Iron Man. Tony has a couple of errands to run, including buying a new TV to replace the one he blasted. Still plenty of day and plenty of crime to take care of, so Tony meets up with the Avengers to take down some more baddies. On the way, Tony saves some skydivers who forgot to pack their parachutes. <laughs> Rookie mistake. When Tony meets up with the Avengers, Cat makes fun of his new suit. This makes Tony angry. Not as angry as the Hulk, but angry enough where they get into a fight, ending with Tony taking Cap's shield. He then heads to the casino to let off some steam and have a glass of gin. Tony meets up with Bruce Banner to have a therapy session where he realizes he was being a bit silly. So he buys some fruit as a peace offering before meeting up with Cap where they apologize to each other. The apology came just in time because there's a new threat in the galaxy who ends up defeating them. Luckily, Tony invented time travel last week so they're able to reset and win. The Tony is back at Tony's place. I, I don't see how that's a party. Then Tony ends the day at a shawarma restaurant to soak up the alcohol. And that's an average day in the life of Tony Stark.